whenever we review a device, usually what happens is, after reviewing, I put the phone away and move on to the next device. But what hardly ever happens is, that the phone gets some new features. Even when this happens, the new features are not very big, that will warrant their own video. But sometimes, something amazing happens. And this is what has happened with the Mate and Lite. There was a pretty big update, and with the update, Huawei included some really major features. So let's get right into them. If you saw the latest Samsung phone, you might have seen that they introduced their face unlock feature, and the Mate and Lite did not have that feature. Well, if you are someone who has a Mate and Lite and wants the face unlock feature, then you will be happy to know that they did include this feature in the new update. The setup part where it records your face is really quick and hassle free, and after that, you just need to press the power button. Then the phone looks for your face and unlocks the phone. So, let's talk about how quick it is to do that whole process. Well, I compared it to the Vivo V7. That phone has a really quick face unlock. And what's surprising is that the Mate and Lite's face unlock is just as quick, even though it just got this feature. This is surprising because this is just the starting point. It will only get better and faster with more time. And it being this good right now is the icing on the cake. The face unlock even works in low light, but it can take a bit longer to recognize your face. And unless you are in a pitch black room where there is no light at all, it should work well. The other big thing in the update is the AR lens. This is the Mate 10 Lite's answer to the augmented reality features in the Pixel and the iPhone. What you do is open the camera, go to the menu and select AR lens. This will give you a whole variety of filters that you can use. I'm not really much of a Snapchat user, but if you are someone who is into these things, you will find a lot to love. In my experience, the AR lens feature works better than the filters on Snapchat. It's faster, it's more stable and overall I found it to be a lot less heading inducing. These are pretty big features, and after updating the phone does feel a bit smoother. I can't stress this enough, that this hardly ever happens. Phones usually never get major features like this after release. I'm really surprised, and I'm really happy. It's not like just another update for the phone, but it feels like the phone got a whole new breath of life, and the Mate and Lite just got a lot better. <laughs> 